I think that the understanding better about how people are approaching this medium, the audio medium is helpful when people are either looking for producers of their books or producing themselves or wondering if they're going to do that or not. But do you think that if an author were to come to you and say, do you think audio is worthwhile? And just setting aside the monetary side of it for the time being, but just from the experience of the listener, how would you address that kind of question? Like how different or special will an audio experience be from the written work? Oh, well, that's actually two questions, I think, <laughs> at least. I think that one of the things about, is it worth it? Is it a good idea? Absolutely for authors, because it totally expands the audience. It never diminishes the audience that has to pick. And actually, I think publishers initially were reluctant that they thought that perhaps having more people listen to audiobooks would somehow diminish the number of people who would access in print a, a book. But it actually has proved many times over that it simply expands the accessibility of the audience. So you get more audience. You don't cut into one audience for a different format. So that's one piece of it. And I think the other piece of it is that there are lots of good reasons to look at audiobooks for authors. And it may not be as straightforward as it appears, except it's a good idea. 